Girl, listen, honey, it is some tea that's going on. When I tell you, when I seen this, I was like, man, this is confirmation. This is confirmation because I always thought something was going on. I always thought something was strange. How Kenya, she got a man, right? She got married, supposedly. And now, y'all new married. We supposed to see y'all lovey-dovey and taking care of each other. But instead, we see Mark is being betrayed as this behind hole and how he mistreats. Uh, Kenya, how he disregards her feelings, how he's all into the baby, but he's not into her. Uh, you don't see no connection, girl. It was no connection. People start to thought that uh, Mark went both ways. You know, they, they was like, oh, hell no. He was part of the Rainbow Coalition. That's what the rumor was about because it didn't seem like he had a connection with Miss Kenya, and people saw it and they felt it. So, girl, Nene Leakes, she is exposing the truth. I don't know if this is the truth, but it sounds about right. She says that Miss Kenya, she said, girl, she, you lucky because she's being nice and she's, she has more information, but she's not going to go into it. But pretty much she was saying that Kenya paid Mark to be on the damn show, y'all. Yes, she said she, you paid Mark to be on the show. Not only that, do you know that marriage license... They ain't even married, y'all. She said, you don't got to worry about getting a divorce, Kenya, because you're not even married. They said they found Beyonce uh, records. They found uh, J-Lo. But uh, Kenya, nope, it's no trace, you know. All it was was a handshake and an agreement, and Kenya paid that money. And let's not talk about that baby, okay? But before we start to talk about the baby, I must say if this is your first time on Gossip Girl XOXO, baby, you in for a treat. When I tell you we gossip over here and we have a good time, we upload what, one, two, Three times a day, are we always up in the community tab, posting up celebrities, dragging them and talking about them. You got to join the party because I don't want you to miss on nothing. So make sure you subscribe, hit that notification. The Real White Coach, you've been spotted. The Real White Coach, you've been spotted. I see you. Shout out to the game member, the real white coach, all right? I thank you for uh, commenting, liking, and sharing, and always showing the party love. So, hey, if you want a shout out, <laughs> it's no problem at all. Make sure you like this video, subscribe, and hit the notifications. Make sure you be, like, one of the first comments or always commenting. And, baby, I'm going to spot you out. It is important to let you know I love you and I see you, okay? So, girl, let me tell you, Miss Nene Lee. She's coming out and she's pretty much saying that uh, Kenya, she went and she got somebody's eggs because I guess she couldn't have it on her own and they use Mark's um, seeds. You get what I'm saying? That white stuff. Yeah, they use Mark's seed and um, they use somebody else's eggs and they put it in the oven, and voila, that's why Nene Leek said the baby looks so much like Mark. That's why Mark is so infatuated with the baby, because he knows that's his baby, you know, biologically. Now, Kenya is the mother, but Nene Leeks is saying biologically, you know, I guess she, she, they don't got the same blood, if you get what I mean. I mean, because she she's the birth mother, but shit, I don't wish I don't think she'll be the biological mother, but she's the birth mother. You get what I'm saying? But that's what Nene Leaks is saying. Girl, ain't that a lot? <laughs> ain't it a lot? We was wondering, like, what happy couple couple just get married and get on the reality TV show just to make a fool out of themselves? Because how Mark the Gray and talk to Kenya. It's like, okay, it makes sense. He's getting paid to be an asshole because ain't no way. Ain't no way a man just going to get up on his show. He just marry you to act the ass. Ain't no way you going to be so in love with this man. You want to display him like this monster because, she, child, this man is just not going to start acting a totally different person overnight. If you know he's a behind hole, why would you put him on the show to expose that he's an asshole. Who does that, you know? Nah, that's just like little Kim 
you know, back in the day when that man was putting a pause on her, saying, come on, let's expose you putting a pause on me. Let's expose how bad you treat me for a check. Ain't nobody doing that. But um, for him to pay, get paid and for her to have a storyline because she didn't have a story, it makes sense. And we know that she has done this type of behavior before. You know, if you guys remember, it was a man that she was with. And, um, damn, I think she paid him. It didn't work out. It was some bull crap. I don't keep up with Kenya, but y'all know I heard the stories. And let's not forget the other man that she was with. He ended up busting her windows, and he's in jail, I think, because he was putting the hands on somebody else, his other girlfriend's girl. She can't pick a good man. She can't. She know how to get him to look good, you know. She know how to make make a, a, a good looker. But somebody that really loves her and genuinely cares about her, we have yet to see it. Shit, even in this fake relationship or this fake marriage with Mark, we didn't see the love that he had for her. I have yet to see Kenya be loved by men and taken care of by men and protected by men. Have y'all? Please let the, let us know what man it was. Because this one, he degrades her and talks to her any type of way. He don't even care about her. Doesn't have the, even a hot sexual attraction to her. It don't seem like. The other one, he put the paws and he threatens her, you know. And then the one before, I don't know what crap was that, but that was a whole sham. So, hmm, Nene Leak, she busting bubbles, boo. They talking about it all on the internet. If you go look up The Real Housewives of Atlanta, you're going to see a whole bunch of drama. Okay, so Kenya, I believe she talked, she heard about what Nene was saying, and she pretty much said, well, you know, it doesn't regard the fact that you, you know, spit on me because she, she brought that back up. And girl, they ain't getting nowhere, okay? But that is something. Can y'all believe it? Do y'all think it's true that Kenya paid Mark to do this stunt, to act like he's married to her, they're not married for real, and that Mark got his, you know, seed, and um, they used somebody else's egg to put in Kenya so she can have her baby. And she is the birth mom. This is her baby. I don't want to disregard that. This is her baby. But Nene Leek said this is not her biological baby. So you get what I'm saying? It's not her eggs. It's somebody else's eggs. But it is her baby. She is the mother. Ain't no denying that. She birthed that baby, and that's just what it is, all right? And I think it's messed up, even if it is true, Nene. Why would you do that to that girl? I mean, she already don't like you, you know? Why would you do that? That's her secret, you know? If she wanted to go to her grave with that, she should have. I don't think it's right for Nene to expose that. Now, that's something. Now, that's too personal. And, and Kenya... Why would you, I don't understand, why would Kenya want to use that as a storyline, especially if you know you want a child and this is what you're going to do? Why would you, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe she didn't want you guys to know and she was trying to cover it up and still use that storyline because she has to display her life on social media and she wants a baby. So she was like, well, shit, let me just rearrange some things, make this a storyline, and she probably thought she was real slick with it. But Nene look like Nene is exposing everything, honey. And it's a damn shame. I can't make this up. Go look and research it. You're going to see Nene is talking about this, y'all. Mm-mm-mm. Nah, this ain't right. Nene, shame on you for exposing that. Uh, I, it, it makes sense, though. I don't know if it's true. You know, we gossip and we do rumors over here, honey. All right? So, hmm, that's the secret of the garden. Okay? But uh, comment. Let us know what you guys think about this. And I'll see you guys sooner than later. Bye.